today's video I'm going to do a basic cam on fleece. I'm going to start by finishing the edge with stitch number eight. It's the overcast for stretch fabric. You can use a overcast foot if you need to, but this stitch tends to be a fairly easy one to stitch. I find most of the time I can use it without an overcast foot. It starts with the lock stitch. Not a, not a back stitch, but a lock, which is just the up and down. If you want to sew it so the rightmost edge of the stitch is just a fraction of a millimeter past the edge of the fabric. Lock it at the end. Even though fleece doesn't fray, I still think it gives a nice, a better looking finished edge. Then for hemming fleece, you really can't press it, so I just finger about an inch on the bottom hem. I use craft clips. After you've sewn for a while, you pretty much can get close to doing it. I said about an inch, and look, right at the inch. Flip it over just to top stitch it. For top stitching the hem on a fleece, I use stitch number three, which is the little lightning bolt stitch. It's a stretch stitch. Since it's fleece and it does stretch a tiny little bit, I tend to go with the stretch stitches with it. Again, this one lock stitch stitches, which is the up and down. I use a large golf wooden golf tee for my owl, just to help guide fabric through. Oops. With the lightning bolt, it does a lock stitch, which is up and down, not a lock uh, back stitch, which is forward and back a little bit. I just use a wooden golf tee as my owl just to help guide the fabric through, not get my fingers too close to the needle. A lot of people like to use a twin needle for top stitch and a hem, which works.
I'm not that big of a fan of the twin needle. I do use it occasionally in swimwear. But for top stitching, I like to send it through the machine twice. Just make sure you get no tunneling between the, if you're doing a double row of hemming. Sometimes with the twin needle you get a tunneling or a channeling. And that's my basic hem on a fleece. And you can see using the stretch, it's stretch stitches, it still stretches a little bit. That's the outside, this is the inside. <laughs> 